So this is the only TV show anywhere on the planet that lets you know exactly what is happening in Liverpool and Merseyside, music and entertainment wise. Yes, if there is a gig, an event or a show in the region, then this is the place to hear all about it. And talking of gigs, we've got four huge bands on the programme this week, kicking things off. A band we've wanted for ages. ages. The Hummingbirds are on the show. Yeah, as well as that, the incredible Silent Cities are here ahead of their huge Threshold Festival gig. And pop rockers My Forever are here too. We go in conversation with All We, we Are, Honorary Scousers, and look where we are. Ah, oh, the amazing brand new Red Door on Berry Street. And you could be here too if yes, you, you fancy would. a big competition coming up with Red Door a little bit later on. My name's Jay Hind. I'm Ellie Phillips. And this is The Guide on Bay TV Liverpool. Are you ready? Let's do this. Let's do it. So a real music extravaganza on this week's show. And we really are at the perfect location for it, aren't I we? I love it in here. My new favourite bar in the city, this Red Door Liverpool. Brand new bar. We were here last week. We're bringing the full programme from here this week on Berry Street. Yes, we are. But you need to behave with the cocktails, mister. Do you know what? I'm up for some cocktail mixing. <laughs> I know what them hummingbirds are like for cocktails. You need to behave with the hummingbirds. Mm, Never mind I'll me. Try. <laughs> anyway, big, big show lined up. All we are are finally on the programme. We went to Manchester. We found them. We interviewed them. We'll bring you that interview a little bit later and this weekend is huge it in is Liverpool. It is massive isn't it? Taking over the Baltic Quarter this weekend it's Threshold Festival from the 27th to the 29th of March and we will be there throughout to bring you a one hour Threshold special on the show next week. See that next week but right now let's get some music from one of the acts doing a big collaboration at Threshold. Take it away Silent Cities. the cold mind Epitome Epitome Petrichor Petrichor When it rains and when it pours Caught over that lived in fear The transform then disappear Petrichor Petrichor When it rains and when it pours Thank you. 
Come over, grab a seat, dude. How gorgeous was that? And uh, people at home who love that can see you this weekend at Threshold Festival, can't they? That's it. Yeah, yeah. Um, it's going to be great. I think it's Drop the Dime, so it's a collaboration event. We're doing a lot of stuff. I think Natalie McCool is kind of collaborating with me. Wow, um, we're, gonna, that's cool. we're actually uh, this Saturday. We're actually going to rehearse and write some new material, which is completely ours. Because obviously, we covered daydream together with the music video my first music video her one of many yeah um, that she's done with um uh, ixiod and laura james yeah um, okay laura james, uh, so threshold this weekend yeah just for anyone watching that doesn't know we want to really push this it's a mm. massive big grassroots local music event mm. uh, why should they go to threshold not just I for think, you <laughs> yeah <laughs> Uh, well, basically, it's a grassroots, but it's also got a lot of like really up and coming talent playing. Um, there's so many artists that I know, and I think I go down personally because I, I just see a lot of friends and stuff yeah. there. And there's, there's a lot of really friendly people go down. It's family focused, so it's just for everybody. Yeah. And like the last few years, this will probably be my fourth year at Threshold, wow. so it's it's uh, definitely Amazing. I always say yes. But this year is different for you because you're performing with Natalie in a collaboration. Mm. But if you could perform with any other artist in Liverpool, who would they be? Who's on your wish list? There is there is a lot of artists I think I'd really like to collaborate with. Um, there's probably two I think I've kind of got your eye on. Got my eye on. <laughs> Go on. Who are I've they? I've always wanted to do something with Johnny Sands. Okay. Yeah. Um, he's really good. Yeah, we wanted to do some kind of landscapey thing yeah. ages ago. Soundscapey rather. Um, next one. Next one would be Silent Sleep because I think hence the name. Silence and Silence. Right. So. <laughs> Silent Sleep collaboration <laughs> with with Silent City is very yeah. very soon. See you at Sorry. Threshold <laughs> this weekend. Okay, so this weekend Threshold. It's on. Looking forward to this big special there next week. We're going to grab a cocktail for you in just a sec. Uh, you can grab a cocktail as well. Many cocktails. Yes. We've got a big prize with Red Door on Berry Street to give away. Get on Twitter now, at the guy at Bay TV. Uh, a 50 quid bar tab. Amazing. Could be yours, just retweet our last tweet. Yeah, and it's a bit of a dodgy picture of us too, isn't it? Enjoying the cocktails here. But right now, from Liverpool to Manchester, this guy toddled up the M62 all on his own, but for a very good cause, to meet a band who were formed in Liverpool. This is when Jay met All We Are. Okay, so we've come over to the dark side for this interview. We're in Manchester, which is fine because it's a fantastic place. We're at the Deaf Institute as a band that we've been trying to get on for ages and ages. All we are are playing tonight. Guys, how are we doing? Yeah, good, good for him, man. Yeah. Thanks for having us. We've been trying to get you on the show for, for a long, long time. You've been chocker busy. Uh, the Scousers are loving you guys at the moment. Yeah, well, we are kind of Scousers in our own little way, you know? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, like, we, we're, yeah, we're a Liverpool band. No Liverpool, no all we are. And... Um, yeah, just love living there, love the city, love making tunes there, that's that. So you, you started in Lippa, which is great to hear, and it's great to hear now so many musicians coming through. Just just tell us about the Lippa experience. Is it like is it like fame? Is it is it I'd love to go and, and spend a day there and see what it is like. Is uh, it easier for a band when you when you're something like that? Yeah, I think like I don't know. I mean we, we actually started the band when we finished, uh for for two reasons. Like one because we wanted to stay together as mates, and, uh, and two, because we wanted to stay in Liverpool as well, because mm. we love the, love the city. Um, so yeah, I mean, like, I guess Liverpool was really nice and it was important for us and that it brought us together and, you know, it was, it was a good place to be creative, but I think, like, our story, like, as a band, really begins afterwards, you know, yeah. after, after we finished. And you still live in the city now, so second home for you guys? Oh yeah, totally. Well, first home, it's really, you know. Home, <laughs> it's more than the second one, it's, it's our home, you know. What do you like about the city? Uh, people, 
Um, it's great. small. It's yeah. really nice. It feels like home. Everyone's friendly. The music scene's great. Mm. I really enjoy being, you know, just being involved in it. It's always great bands every night of the week to go and watch and listen. So there's tons going on, yeah. isn't there? I think like one of my favorite things about Liverpool is just the people. Like, mm. do you know what I mean? And there's like a, you know, it's kind of similar to Ireland. You know, you just go, you go into a pub, you end up chatting to people. It's sort of funny, like you know. <laughs> Let's talk about your journey, because obviously you, you formed the band, as you say, after, after Lipper. Past six months, it's really, really, really coming to a head. You, you're doing great things. It must feel good now. It feels like you, you, you're there now, and obviously it's been coming for a while. Um, big smiles at the moment, I'm presuming. <laughs> yeah, we, we work hard, you know. We've been working hard for a long time, and it's, it's really nice to see that people starting to enjoy what we're doing. And it's really, I don't know, it feels really great to be be able to do this. It's a privilege, mm. really, to, to do what you love and, and travel around and, and play for people. So. How fab are all we are? Real chat from those guys. And I really love that new single, Upmost Good. Check that great out. Great tune, great album as yes. well. And great to see the guys finally got them on the show. All we are, they're playing Sound City at the end of May. Yeah, when we come back, we're joined by local lads, the Hummingbirds. They're going to perform and have a giggle with us. And pop rockers, My Forever, are here with us too. Yes, and we talk Sleeping Beauty, Nicki Minaj, and Sex in yeah. Suburbia. No, it's not one of Ellie Phillips' Saturday Night <laughs> Out. It's the guide gig listing straight after this. See you soon. Welcome back to The Guide. I'm Ellie, he's Jay, and this is your show for your city. And look where we are. The uber cool, the super funky. I love it in here. My new favourite place, Red Door, Liverpool on Berry Street. Do you like it because it matches your hair? Why does it match my hair? Because you're a redhead. You are so genius. <laughs> Strawberry blonde. True. Uh, anyway, lots going on in the city. We've got two big gigs to tell you about. Mm. Obviously, Threshold this weekend, but Steve Langstaff is playing Leaf as well on Bowl Street. And Simple Minds are coming to Amazing. town. 2nd of April, check it out at the Empire. Talking of the Empire, Claire Sweeney and the gang are going to be there on the 30th and the 31st of March with Sex in Suburbia. And then on the 7th of April, Dancing its way onto stage is going to be Dirty Dancing the Musical. Oh, looking forward. No yes. one puts Ellie Phillips in the corner. No, they don't. no, no. no. <laughs> um, another big gig happened. I'm going to lose some real man points here. Babe, you, you had to have some to begin with. So. Yeah, I suppose. Blue are coming <laughs> to the Philharmonic Hall on the 2nd of April. One for the money Ooh, and two for the It's my birthday, that as well. Blue, Ellie Phillips' birthday. I think I'll go with Blue, You are baby. so mean. Anyway, get your bleep buttons at the ready. Nicki Minaj, she's going to be at the Echo Arena on the 6th of April. Uh, but she will not be as loud as this one will be when Ben Howard is there on the 13th. Yes. Can't wait for that. Ben Howard at the Echo Arena coming up very soon. Uh, as well, Easter Panto. Yes. Um, we've got to tell you all about St. Helens Theatre Royal Easter Panto, which is Sleeping Beast and Beauty and the Beauty at the Epstein Theatre. Wait, 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 wait. Beauty and the Beauty and the Sleeping Beast? Sorry, Beauty and the Beast <laughs> and the Sleeping Beauty. Uh, both two Easter Pantos you've got to check out. Sleeping Beast is you. Yes, it is. See I do like morning. <laughs> anyway, uh, coming up very soon out on stage, the first heat for the competition is going to be at Constellations in the Baltic Quarter. It's a huge competition to find the future music stars of Liverpool and the first heat is on the 15th of April and a big big charity gig happening this Saturday Titanic Hotel Prostate Cancer UK is the charity music from Asa Murphy and a big male fashion catwalk yes. check it out on our Twitter at the guide Bay TV right now uh, something else to check out is the new cover videos mm. from a band called my forever doing massive things have a look at this there is a fire inside of his heart and a riot about to explode in the flames where is your God? Where is your God? Where is your God? Love the look of that video. More on that in just a second. Listen, we're here at Red Door on Berry Street. Amazing little place. Uh, if you fancy being here too, we've got a big competition. 50 quid to spend. We'll sort you a booth out, loads of cocktails. Ellie Phillips will even come and say hello while you're here. What about that for a prize? Uh, get on Twitter right now, at the guy, Bait TV, for more info. 
Dave Ingham is with me for my forever. How are you doing? I'm good, thanks. Yeah, really we, good. We've just seen your video shot yeah. at St George's Hall. Yeah. Big cover, and it's doing massive things online. We have to get you on. on yeah, the show. it's doing really well. Like an iconic venue to uh, film it in as well. So really, really pleased to get that one out. My yeah. forever have got a big Liverpool link. Yeah. Um, you're a Leeds lad, but big, big Liverpool link. Yeah. Loads yeah. of gigs here. You've got yeah. Liverpool management. Yeah, we have. Um, yeah. You think a lot of this city, don't you? Yeah, I absolutely love this city. It's got obviously the musical background in the city is massive, and. Uh, it feels great to be able to be here and play gigs here and stuff. You know, we've done some great events here, so yeah. You were Radio 1's um, track of the week yep. not long back. Yep. You've, you've had national airplay, you've yep. played to 100,000 people across the country. Yep. Massive success, mate. Yeah, it's been going really well. Like, all the gigs last year were just huge. And uh, yeah, like I said, I played to a lot of people last year and yeah. Radio 1 and everything like that. So it's a huge platform. So, yeah, and now you're on the guide, which is even exactly, bigger. Yes. Even bigger. Yeah, exactly. What's next for Mike Forever? Uh, writing a brand new record at the moment. Uh, already got first mixes of the tracks done and stuff, which is great. Uh, Release a new single, great. beginning of summer. Brand new record out in summer. Gigging, touring, festivals, everything like that. So Can that's, that's we get cool. you and the band on the stage behind yes, us, where the uh, hummingbirds yeah, are just setting up very yeah. soon? Is that okay? Loved it. Loved okay. It, yeah. In the meantime, though, before the hummingbirds, we're going to hear some of your new single. Tell yes, us uh, light of the night. It was shot around Yorkshire and um, literally shot in so many beautiful locations and stuff. So wow. fantastic. Yeah, fantastic. Real. Well, four videos of all them videos shot in Liverpool on our Twitter feed right now at the Guide Bay TV. Dave, thank you for joining no us, mate. So Ellie's with the hummingbirds straight after this. Brand new from Mike Forever. In my eyes and it's a fine to what I really was on my own to be the man at the cost I had to learn to live with the ones I lost I paid no So we finally managed to get these guys on the show. We've been trying for ages to get them, but we did the hummingbirds and they're going to be performing live for us at the very end. But before they do that, um, we thought we'd grab a quick chat with two of the members, Mike and Jay. We couldn't get all five because you all talk far too much. So we thought we'd get the two of you to have a quick ramble. Um, so you guys have got so much coming up, haven't you? You've got um, so many gigs, but the big one, I guess, is Sound City. You're looking forward to that one? Yeah, definitely. Um... Completely different to the years though. Yeah, it's we've played a couple of years now and this is for us this is like it feels more like a festival that it's all in it's all in one place. It's uh, it's like a festival. You know, the poster, you can tell yeah. the place away from the poster that they've got like different stages, different lineups, different headliners. Whereas last year it was kind of like we went to try and went to go to the Kooks gig yeah. and it was just everyone who like bought tickets to the festival had tried to go to this one gig and it was just chaos. So now I think that they've I think they've, you know, prepared for it I guess. Yeah. Um, we know them and they're doing really well work, like good work in yeah. the office, they're working all year round, you know. To make it like, what it yeah, is. yeah, and it's and like it's I'm glad that it's paid off, it's become I, I, is it the biggest festival in Liverpool now? It's the biggest UK metropolitan music festival. Okay. Our mental <laughs> that is a big one, that, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. And you guys are like regulars, aren't you? Because you've done it for yeah. years. Yeah, we've done I mean we've we first I think the first Sound City gig we played was in uh, Bowl Street <laughs> Coffee. Right. And we turned up and didn't expect it at all. Like it was just amazing. Um like a shocker, like absolutely right. And then, and then they had us play on the. We played on the ferry as well. We did like a pop up gig on the ferry. Amazing. We did Rico Chambers as well. Yeah. The album is it's coming together now, is it? And you, you did pledge music, and when it when it goes out, your your pledge music fans get something really special, don't they? Yeah, they do. They get like a um, like a limited edition one if you like. Yeah. So. And we had a bit of trouble with them at the minute because we didn't give them it when they wanted oh, it. Oh, it's one of them. But it'll be worth the wait when it comes yeah, out. Yeah, exactly. That's Amazing. what I'm trying to say. We're going to give them a few more tracks and yeah. that as well to yeah. satisfy everyone. Yeah. So. And you guys have got a gig coming up this Saturday at the Zanzibar. Yeah. We can go and see you there. And yeah. of course, you've got Sound City coming up. We are going to see you perform live right now. And we're putting out an exclusive track from the Hummingbirds online. So check out our Twitter at The Guide Bay TV. Guys, thank you so much for joining us today. Much. Thanks for I'll leave you to set up and yeah. good luck. Nice thank one. You. Thank you. So, looking forward to seeing these guys perform. We've been trying to get the hummingbirds on the programme for, for ages. ages and ages. <laughs> what a show we've had. Really big show. We've had though. All We Are, we've had Mike Forever, yep. we've had Silent City, yep. we're about to have the hummingbirds, and we're about to do some cocktails at the amazing, the super uber cool, uh, brand new Red Door Liverpool on Berry Street. Defo, we're checking out this yeah, place. Yeah, we love it here. It's great through the week as well. Loads of music. And they have a big live music night every Friday night too, so check that out. Talking of live music, this weekend is Threshold Festival. It's going to be amazing. Taking over the Baltic Quarter. And of course, we're gagging in on the action as well. <laughs> yes, we uh, are. So get yourself down there. Full 60-minute show yes. next Thursday. Yeah, do get yourself down there, though. We are both going to be there. So much great live music on. Huge, huge 
huge list of artists performing. For all the details, check out our Twitter at the Guide Bay TV. You can't miss us, lanky ginger lad, probably <laughs> oh, bevied at the bar, and uh, young Ellie Phillips flirting with all the bands at Threshold. So come and see it, come and check us out, and follow us at the Guide Bay TV. Yes. Uh, right now, though, we better pass over to the stage at Red Door. It's time for the hummingbirds and time for us to have a little cocktail uh, as made by the gentleman behind us. We'll see you next Thursday, 8.30 with the Guide on Bay TV Liverpool. Me 